Well, hello guys. Welcome back to the bench here with Gilly. Thank you for coming in and taking a look at my channel. So, today we're going to do a little kit review here. I've been waiting for a while to get. It's finally gone down in price, so no further ado, here she is. This is a German submarine type XX1 with interior. Like I said, it's finally gone down in price for me in my price range. I'm not going to say how much, but <laughs> as you can see here, some of the interior parts that's going to come along with the kit. And yeah, I got a few 144 submarines, but no interior kits until now. The kit is by Revell. It's a 144. It's going to be 53.1 centimeters long. It's kit number. 05078 by Ravel. Oh, that's all fine. There's the let's see if we can zoom you into that. Let's see. Sorry, camera issues. Anyway, it's very fine. I can barely read it myself, so... Well, no further, let's get into this kit. Like I said, it's all brand new. Just recently got it. This thing's still in its package. There's a tiny little instruction book. As you see, it's not as big as... Both sides of my palm of my hand. And here's all the kit parts. Can't see what I'm cutting here, so let's here, let's just whack it open. One big piece bag, of course, by Rebel. Gotta love Rebel. And you can see here, here's the two-piece haul. One, two, three. Oh, three spans of my hand handprint. A little bigger than my thumb. Got some nice detail here. A couple of rays. Panel line. Oh, that's not too bad. We got some interior work here. Inside detail. Looks a little warped. I don't know. Maybe it's supposed to be like that. Oh, you guys tell me. Does that look warped? Hold up. We'll find out when we put her together. And the other part that's free. Look at that detail there. If you can see it. Nice little kit. I'll have some still pictures here and then you guys get a better look at all this stuff. Nice little propellers there. Yeah, part of the outside top half. Tower. Ah, you got some nice detail underneath too. Nice. Anyways, that's part two. Let's open this bag, see what's in there. Time to change the blade in that one. Boom. And bag number two. Two sprues in that one. All right, here we got some interior parts. Might look good. A couple of bulk bulkheads. Not sure what these are. We all can see that, eh? Let's zoom you into those ones. There, these are the summer the torpedoes. More bulkhead. There's torpedo racks. A couple of plumbing, flooring. More bulkheads. More flooring. 
Look at that nice pattern on there. I don't know if you can see it. Let's see. Yep. Yeah, there we go. Same thing with this one. Nice detailed floor patterning. Flip it over. We got some more detail in here. Must be the inner wall of the submarine. Back area. Here's another spot. Yeah, like I said, I'll take some pictures. We got some ladders there. Not sure what all these are, but yeah, plumbing. We got some plumbing stuff. Take a look at the next one. There's the cute motor. Some more walling. That must be the engine room. A couple turbines there, I'm guessing. Well, let's zoom you out so you can get a better look at this one. A couple more bulkheads. Flip it over, not much on the back, just uh, more details on the bulkheads there. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Four sprues. And we'll get to the instruction book. You see it's not very big. It's kind of weird for Ravel. Usually you got this big book. They always hide their decals and stuff on the inside. And there you go. There's the decal sheet and flags. Some deep decals for the interior and the sub. There I'll zoom you guys in so you can get a better shot at that. Let's see. Uh, tilted here so there's no glare from the lighting. Yeah, I'll just put my thumb over that one because we all know what happens when that pops up. There you go. Zoom you back out. Let's move this. And little signia flags. And here's the book. Flip it over to the back, and usually Rebel has all these numbers, so there's 55 steps, 12 pages, and there's your color for your submarine. We'll quickly skim through this and paint callouts. We all love the Rebel paint callouts. picture of the sprue parts and I'll be quiet and I'll slowly skim through this enough for you guys to look at you can see each sheet has so many parts to do so yeah a lot going on next page Looks overwhelming, but don't worry, it's not. Take it one one box at a time, you'll be fine. Again. Yep, these are your engines, your engine bay. And you can do some rigging, which would be cool. Another than that, 12 pages and we're done. Pretty cool. So, that was a quick look at the German submarine with interior. Some pictures. Da, da, da. Hope you guys like it. And like I said, I'll have some still shots of the parts. And hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you on the next one. Thank you.